Today's health news will bring hope to the families of millions of Americans. The FDA just approved the first Alzheimer's drug meant to slow progression of the disease. Laquembi is designed to clear plaque buildup in the brain and with the authorization, it could broaden access for up to roughly 1 million people with early onset Alzheimer's. Medicare declined to cover this until a full passage from the FDA. Without insurance, the medicine costs more than $26,000 a year. Now, doctors are emphasizing that this isn't a cure and not everyone will be eligible. Already uh, having these conversations that sometimes aren't uh, so easy. It's not that we know it's not good for people with moderate or severe disease. It's just that we don't know. Yeah, Dr. Honig says side effects could be worse for some people who are further along in their diagnosis with Alzheimer's. But still, today's FDA action sets the stage for the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services to expand coverage for drugs that slow Alzheimer's progression.